everyone this is Sajad from trade with Asim and Sajad I'm here again with a short analysis on euro USD GBP USD and gold uh, before moving to euro USD let's see economic calendar uh, this early morning we missed some Australian data there was some good volatility in Australian US and all other pairs uh, right now we uh, we are having some uh, euro news but I'm not sure whether it can make any bigger impact on the trades uh, but later this evening we have some US data and Canadian data and definitely it will it will uh, create some volatility and we can just you know get some benefit from this uh, also we just check the dollar index and if we can see it's been weaker for the last four days and it's still going down uh, my range for today can be from uh, this current ra range 88.86 to 88.4 uh, this uh, at this point it might you know just continue going down or might just retrace a bit so we'll be careful uh, while it touches this uh, price. I advise all my members and newcomers, uh, please uh, keep uh, one chart for DXY dollar index. So if you know the dollar movement, then you can decide whether to buy or sell any other pair. So let's move to Euro USD, and this is a daily chart of Euro USD. And if you can see in this uh, whole week, and <coughs> it's going so well uh, yesterday. Uh, Euro did so well and right even now it looks very strong uh, for today my range will be from 1.2380 to 1.2535 and above uh, it will be interesting to see here uh, I have been bullish on this for the uh, start of the week and we are having some very good trades hope you guys also had uh, some profit yesterday and a few days back and just be careful I'll, uh, if you can see the day uh, one hour chart here it is so if you can see here uh, it's just making a bullish flag here uh, just uh, wait for the entry uh, it's not uh, good advice to buy here or even sell here M many of members I'm seeing they are just wait uh, just waiting to sell but it can be risky even the buyer so just wait for a confirmation and then you decide whether you want to go short or you want to buy it so moving to GBP USD GBP USD also did well um, I'm just surprised it's not doing much like uh, euro USD so we can expect some good uh, momentum right now but if you can see this uh, bullish channel and it's uh, near this I expect that it might just start retracing from here but also depends on the dollar weakness if the dollar is much weaker then it can you know just jump and uh, go higher if uh, we can just draw some uh, range for us uh, maybe it can mm, uh, my range is from 1.3920 and uh, if it goes up uh, it can go to 1.4060 and above so I'll be more bullish on this rather than selling it but I will see on the smaller time frames if I can get in for uh, short term trades but on the long term if we can see it's a bullish trend so be careful with your trades and do you know use your own diligence it's just my personal opinion uh, moving to gold if we can see gold we, gold was the best pair uh, yesterday many of us they bought gold and had very good results uh, even today it's uh, although the market is very slow but it seems like a, you know another bullish leg up and for today if it can go up it might touch 1366 and above even or if it comes down then it can come to 1340 I wish all you uh, have a very good trading day today uh, just uh, trade uh, very carefully uh, we are not here to lose so uh, just try your best to enter at a very good uh, entry price uh, so uh, I'll see you tomorrow again uh, again uh, wish you a, be a best of luck for today uh, take care of yourself bye bye